You know, I, uh, I keep wondering why they haven't done a gritty reboot of Nick Arcade yet. Two children, alone in the vast hellscape of a future world made a wasteland by video wizards. They travel around various locales, sailing on a raft, touching light in an abandoned temple, all to find the decaying cybernetic corpse of the original games master, the man known only as Philip. And they arrive in his darkened laser lair, and he asks them various questions, including one where he shows them pictures of various things really fast, and they have to figure out which one is Aerosmith and which one is White Snake. Yes, good movie. Finally, they face Mongo, Scorchia, and the wizard Morlock before finally facing their rival. Game over. The town bully. I'm gonna stop before I, you know, <laughs> keep writing fanfiction, and instead invite you to watch this episode of Cartridge Blowers, where we challenge each other just like on The Real Show from, like, 30 years ago. <sighs> anyway, we play tiny snippets of various games, some of them even blindfolded. Hollywood, if you don't like Mongo, and you don't like my sweet spec script, then you can suck your own dick. It's Cartridge Blowers, episode 59. Nick Arcade for extreme adults. You know, on second thought, that whole thing was actually a bad idea because we know how the movie ends. The kids fail because on Nick Arcade, fucking kids always fucking fail. Just touch the fucking coin, you fucking dipshit. I just YNIN Podcasting, part of the EDOC NameLock Interactive Network. everybody, and welcome to YNIN's Cartridge Blowers, the show where we give video games a second chance to make a first impression. I'm Cody Coleman. With me, as always, is Nikki Wright. Matthew Krua. So much rage. And Dylan Frisbee. <laughs> <laughs> you totally football teamed that, <laughs> that like, paper. Like, Dylan, Dylan, that was a really important document. I don't... <laughs> No, my taxes! <laughs> no return for you, sir. You have no idea how many Google podcasts that the IRS watches just for moments like this. <laughs> All of them. They have a special team. Why their suicide rate is so high. <laughs> <laughs> well, then, everybody, if you uh, would like to get to a special part of this show, you can skip ahead if you are watching on YouTube. I clicking in the timestamp below. However, there's not going to be a whole lot of jibber-jabber in this week because our theme is Nick Arcade Challenge Week. It's happening for a fourth Woo! time. Yeah. This is it's where we... What? Always a good week. Cause yeah. We just challenge ourselves, you know? It's always yeah. fun. Yeah. We issued challenges to each other, and uh, we're going to see if we were able to to uh, win, essentially. Um, maybe. Maybe not. We'll see. <laughs> anyway, uh, subscribe to us on the YouTube if you haven't already, or uh, various other place places that you can subscribe to podcasts. Um, so, I don't know if there's anything you guys just really wanted to uh, talk about that we played this week, uh, or I'm... if we should just get right into it. All right, we can talk about what we played. Okay, mm -hmm. Matt, what'd you yeah, play? We got a little time. Um, I uh, Dragon Ball Z Universe came out yesterday. Oh, yeah, how was that? It's fun. It's really good. Is it? Yeah. Did you ever play Fantasy Star Online? Uh, no, but I know people who have. Okay. It's <laughs> it's kind of it's kind of like help that. Help for the basis of comparison. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of like that, except you get to make your own Goku. Um, pretty much like the same thing, except really fun. Make um, your character creation interesting. I like playing with the character creation screens in various games. <laughs> There's 800 different costume pieces. Whoa. That you can pick between. Um, so right now I have my character's name, because the storyline is that your character is summoned by a wish to help the time stream, and he summons, like, the strongest warrior ever, which is your created Mary Sue Do Not Steal character. And, uh, so my greatest warrior of all time is a gentleman by the name of Yamcha Jr. And, <laughs> and Yamcha Jr. is dressed like Dan Hibiki from Street Fighter. 
<laughs> wow. <laughs> Does nothing but uh, play dead. He just plays dead and dances a lot. That's kind of amazing. Um, uh, just like Dan. <laughs> pretty much. Um, I haven't gotten to play a whole bunch, but there's a, there seems to be just tons to do, and it's really fun so far. I'll probably play more done with the show tonight. All right, um, cool. Have you been then, streaming? Have you been Cartridge Blowers guiding? I have I have taken a short break from it. I Probably this weekend, though, I'll probably be streaming some Dragon Ball. All right. Because um, it should be a fun game to I watch. I would like to watch um, that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and, and mostly I've been playing console games. Aside from, like, all I've played is uh, Civilization. I've yeah. been playing a lot of Civilization um, since I'm playing some online multiplayer games with some people um, via the giant multiplayer robot website. I wanted to practice with the civs that I was using because I picked random. And so I'm like, I want to practice and get good with them. So I played it through a game with each of them and, and won um, cool. to try and get good. So now I have like 110 hours of Civilization extra. Shit. Of everything I've played and I need to die. Um, <laughs> and then lastly, playing a lot of Smash Brothers. Um, Mostly trying to get the challenges, the challenge window. Have you yeah. done any of those? Uh, I have been actively trying to. When we're watching TV that I don't want to watch, I just pull yeah. off the gamepad. Yeah. Uh, we've got five left. We have five wow. left. Wow. Those is, are really uh, fucking hard challenges towards the top. You, I, I, I beat duck. I beat all-star mode on hard with Duck Hunt earlier. I did that too, yeah. It, it was a bitch. It took me a couple <laughs> days. It took me a couple months of like, <laughs> of like being like getting to the end and dying and being frustrated and saying fuck this shit and stopping. <laughs> um, but yeah, so all I've got left is beating classic mode on hard on nine point difficulty with no not losing any lives. Which fuck that. That's um, super hard. I'm, I'm gonna keep trying, but fuck that. That last boss <laughs> is mega hard. It's really fucked up, man. Like I can't like I, even though even like if I if I die I keep going because then I can at least beat it over 8.0 with somebody which is a different challenge and I get to that last part and it turns into the master fortress where you have to go around and uh, go through the maze and uh, it's just like it, I die right the very last second and it's so frustrating isn't it <laughs> like I've never had a game that just like is all is like. Oh yeah, you're doing fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Rug. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> like you asshole. It just wants to fuck you over so like, bad. I would rather die early. I would too, because then would... you know you can give up. <laughs> right. Exactly. So uh, not waste my time. But yeah, so almost almost done with the challenges, and then I can just actually have fun with the game again. So cool. Nice. Fantastic. Yeah. Um, do you play anything else? Anyone play anything else they want to talk about? I did not. Dylan played a game called Demon Souls for the PS3. <gasps> cool, Demon Souls is awesome. <laughs> How'd you like it? It's hard. It is. <laughs> yeah. He looks defeated already. <laughs> it's. Really he got it hard. as a really late Christmas present, and um, our friend was really excited about it because he said it kind of reminds me of those really old like Nintendo games where they were really unforgiving <laughs> and. You know, if you fuck up, you you know you die and you have to almost start over. <laughs> um, right. So uh, Dylan played it for about two or three hours. And then stopped forever. And then, well, he he became kind of busy. Um, yeah. I, Dylan's a busy man. Lately, yeah. yeah. The Nikki has not even seen me at all this week. <laughs> wow. The good. Th I, then this is the time. <laughs> Through the fucking card. I, I was wondering why you look so happy, Nikki. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that's unfortunate. So, I'm so happy. Anyway, <laughs> um, and Mario Kart Eight. We played Mario Kart Eight. Heck yeah, we should all play Mario Kart Eight together. Yeah, we should. That would be. We nice. should. I'm really not good at it. <laughs> I am. <laughs> yeah, I think okay. well, I haven't had as much practice as you guys. That's but... true. If I remember correctly, Cody's better than me, which sucks. Where I I think we're a little on par. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I feel like I'm better than most people like that I know at video games. And when someone beats me, it just makes me want to train harder and destroy you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I am your cell. Yeah, so I'm going to have to train in 100 times gravity. Yeah, <laughs> the hyperbolic time chamber. That is yeah. good. Um... I'm just trying to go through an unlock. We're just trying to go through and unlock everything right now. So we're still doing a lot of the 50 CC matches to unlock all of those phase stages. I don't know if you can play the harder ones and still unlock like extra. Um, you have well, to. I mean, 
I mean, yeah, there's, you, there, there's something for everything. So yeah. okay, yeah. yeah. And then um, when our friend came over, he was like, "Well, let's play," and he immediately jumped into 150 CC, and I'd never played that because I've only done the 50 stuff. And I was like, "Oh my gosh, this is." I forgot that there's such a significant jump in difficulty. Yeah. Like, it's, um, it's, it's definitely a change, but once you, like, I think it's also got a pretty good learning curve where you can get used yeah. to it pretty easily. Oh, yeah, I started I started to, and yeah. um, I mean, it wasn't so bad, but at first I was like, oh, why am I oh, having but, a hard time with the things I, that I know I can do? I, I totally had that happen, too, and I was yeah. playing by myself trying to unlock stuff. <laughs> but, but now I don't. I would never want to race anything other than 150. Well, sure, yeah. Well, cool. Um, a lot of fun. I enjoy it. <laughs> if there's nothing else, let's get into. Some I want to get the DLC. Oh, the DLC is great. <laughs> DLC is perfect, and there's some new no. ones coming out in a couple months. So. Yeah. Like it, isn't it April? I think. I thought it was May. Maybe it's May. I don't know. Yeah, but still, not that far. So. Yeah, for sure. It's like the the last DLC pack was great. Uh, it was fantastic. I I yeah. loved the Zelda level. It was it, it was really neat. Anyway, um, let's go ahead and get some challenges because these tend to run kind of long. So uh, right. Matt, you're starting us out. Me. All right, cool. Um, well, I I don't know which video is which. I just know what their times are. Okay, but I can look at the the previews here and tell you what I did. So the first challenge um, was uh, from Cody Coleman. <laughs> That's me. And, and it was one of his older challenges that I don't think anyone ever touched. Um, but I touched it now. <laughs> here. Oh, well, that's disturbing. That sounds terrible, yeah. yeah. Um, that's the title. Touching <laughs> Cody Challenge. <laughs> I fail. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so this challenge was Miss Pac-Man. And uh, I don't know if you guys know this, but I have the world record for Miss Pac-Man. Do you what? really? What? Yeah, well... Like in in my house, um, <laughs> you have the house record. Like my name is there. The initials, yeah, the initials A S S are right there on, <laughs> on the arcade machine. Um, but um, so it was make it to the second maze without dying, and with eating all of the fruit, or without the fruit in under three minutes. So that's my challenge. I don't know. That's it. Okay. I give it. A shot. I think I give it a shot. I'm playing the Super Nintendo version of Ms. Pac Man. Right on. It right, might be so. a little easier, actually, but yeah, that's fine. Let's, let's see. And it was really weird because there's, like, no music at the beginning. Yeah, it's very quiet. Well, there's music once it starts, but there's nothing here. It's literally silent. Oh, okay. um, yeah, there it is. So here I am. I, I'm Ms. Pac-Man. All right. And, uh... Like, I don't know if you've ever played a Pac-Man game before, but uh, you got eight dots. Yeah. And the power pellets so that you can yeah. get ghosts. And here I go. It's time to, it's time to get ghosts. Ooh, there's a fruit. I gotta get that fruit. That's what I'm, oh, that was my goal. Power pellets. I was going for the fruit instead of the speed. That's what I wanted. Yeah, well, absolutely. That's the challenge. But then none of it mattered. Oh, yeah. oh you <laughs> died! Yeah, I died immediately. I failure. <laughs> you, f um, you are a failure. No, yeah. you're not ready. You're done. <laughs> I am. I am. I am done. Game over. Yeah. Um, yeah. So that sucked. Um, so I, I was feeling pretty low. Uh, I was like, man, I'm, I normally have a pretty good record with challenges. I want to try something I can beat. Um, okay. But I said, fuck that. Let's do something difficult. So <laughs> good. I took another Cody challenge. And uh, I think most, if not all, of my challenges are Cody ones, which is sad. Nothing against you guys. It was just technical issues. Yeah, um, you know, I, tr I tried. I tried. I um, issued a lot of them. There was a lot to choose from. I, I have, I have one Nikki challenge. But um, so this challenge is also from Cody. I think this is one of your newer ones, uh, which was Kirby Superstar for the Super Nintendo. Um, had to beat level one of Spring Breeze. You know, play yes. Kirby Superstar. There's multiple games in it that you can pick from. Beat level one of Spring Breeze either in under two and a half minutes without taking damage, or defeat it in under two minutes without copying abilities. Um, so, in the spirit of the Touch Fuzzy Get Dizzy Challenge that I completed last time, I decided to go for both at the same time. Oh! Uh, <laughs> Alright! Nice. So, the timer, like, this video, uh, the timer starts, and I'm not going to tell you whether or not I make it, but the timer starts when I get control of Kirby. Okay. 
All right. Let's do it. Speed run rules. All right, here we go. So I'm selecting Spring Breeze. If you ever played Superstar, it's awesome. It's a fucking great game. And it's co-op. So yeah. It's a great two-player game. Um, but it gives me a tutorial, even though I told it not to give me a tutorial. Yeah. <laughs> it and knows what's best for go. you. Go. So we start at 19 seconds. All right. So I'm trying to get the controls under under control. I'm like, oh, God, I almost got hit immediately. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not really, I'm like, fuck this door. Let's just, let's just go. I forgot I'm on a timer. I can't dick around. And then I remembered, oh, I can just blow my breath on people and they die. This is yeah. great. That makes it a little easier. Well, I mean, you know, it's it's a difficult move to do, though, because you got to gotta time it, and if there's more than one enemy, you only have one shot. That's true. Then I remembered I can also... You, <laughs> you, you can suck up uh, the enemies and spit them out, yeah. Yeah. So here, you would have to eat the bombs and spit them back out. Which I did. There you go. And, like, it sucks because the bomb power right there is, like, the best power-up you can get at this stage of the game. And I couldn't absorb him. Blue. Get out. All right. So I'm trying to keep my speed up. <laughs> I had to bear. Um, so we're at uh, a little over a minute now. Uh, and I believe it's two minutes, correct? Yes. Okay. Because I'm not... I, I said the time because I'm not sure if I do it or not. <laughs> okay. I think I do though. Let's see. All right. Here's so now the boss. We... you're getting oh there. Oh my god! Why are all these platforms here? And I haven't been hit yet. Shit! Shit! Fuck! Oh, no! All right. You can still go for the not copying abilities. Exactly. I'm like, well, at least I can get one challenge done. Give me these. Give me these fucking apples. Go! I almost got hit by that one that dropped on me. Alright, oh, he's dead. Oh! Hold on, hold on. Level's not over. No, you have to get the sword oh. start. Oh. Alright, it's done. There you go. Nice. Yeah. You made it with a few seconds to spare. With a few seconds to spare. Congratulations. Yes. So at the very least, I got half of it done. Yeah. Um, you don't You don't have to knock out both ends of that uh, challenge immediately. It's okay. No, no. I feel, I feel like a loser, Cody, even though I won. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're only half a loser. Thank you, Cody. You're welcome. That's, that's, what, that's what my parents always told me. <laughs> um, for my third challenge, I did I did a grand total of seven uh, that we'll see on the show today. Uh, I took another one of Co uh, Cody's newer challenges, almost called you Kirby, uh, which was <laughs> F-Zero for the Super Nintendo, which is beat level one without hitting the walls. Okay. Uh, and by beat level one, I'm assuming you just meant the first race of Grand Yeah, Kirby. yeah, yeah. All right, so that's what I did. Okay. All right, let's go. Um... Now, if you've never played an F-Zero uh, for the Super Nintendo, it's really hard to control. <laughs> it is. It's fucking difficult as shit. This was one of my harder challenges. So, I... I and, and when you said beat it, I assumed you meant get first. Uh, well, no. <laughs> I actually can, was going to be easier on you. Because you can... I was, I was just going to... If I played this, I was thinking I'll just slow down and I won't hit any walls, and I'll yeah. come in last, but I'll still win. Yeah. Well, you ha you have to get you have to get third to continue on in the Grand Prix. Yeah. Oh. I was kind of thinking for continuing on. I was thinking like third. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Something that would allow um, you to progress. But right. I decided I'm going for first. All right. So I I I I I got up to first, and the thing that sucks about F Zero, and I forgot I haven't played this game in a million years. Um. Is that you? Like once you get in the first, they start spawning all these fake cars in front of you yeah. that aren't actual other racers, but they're just there that, for you to hit. Right, they're just there to hit you and knock you off the track. So yeah. I'm that trying. That sucks. Yeah, so I'm trying my best to one take these turns. I'm using the uh, shoulder buttons to kind of uh, drift into them a little bit. That's um, smart. You're doing really well so far. Yeah, no, I was pretty pleased. Uh, so we're uh, and there's a lot of laughs. Oh, oh no! Yeah. <laughs> and the, that flashy ah. guy aims for you. Did you see that? Didn't touch it. Look at my health. Oh man, look at you! Yeah, I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm good. That was just fucking barely. <laughs> yeah, that was lucky. <laughs> like I, I remember, like just thinking. Oh no! Oh my god! Um, we got two laps left. All right. 
This is a bit more so, intense than I thought. I mean, Courses uh, take forever in this game. They do. Uh, later games are like, yeah, three laps is fine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> in fact, like every single game after this is three lap standard. Yes. God, uh, fuck you. The, the the flashing ones kind of aim for you. And yeah. Try to, try to hit you. <laughs> They're the dick cars. Right. Like, who did that? Who programmed them? Like, Assholes. Who was driving them? Some kind of sh- some kind of shit eater. Um, <laughs> but uh, so here I am. I got the last lap, and just oh, oh. you did you hit you died. I, 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 I you were it. doing so well, oh. Matt. Today's just a day of failure for me. I'm not, I'm not uh, happy. Matt, just turn off Google Plus. I'm gonna turn off, <laughs> I'm gonna turn, I'm gonna turn off everything. Just you know. <laughs> no, oh, just wait until you see my challenge. Okay. I'm uh, um. So I was like, man, that sucked. That was I was so close. Like it was talking about with Smash Brothers earlier. It sucks to get so close to the end and, and fail. Yeah. Yeah. Much better um, to die early. Definitely. So I uh, decided I would go for another Cody challenge, an easier game. Uh, I, another game I haven't played in a very long time. Um, but I, I feel like it's just a, it's a simpler game because it's made for for babies. It's a baby game. Uh, <laughs> this is Bubble Bobble for the yeah. NES, which is a super cool game. Uh, and the challenge was defeat the first four levels by popping all the enemies and eating the resulting fruits. Yep. Now I'm under the impression that you have to do that anyway to pass the levels. Can you beat the level without eating? Uh, the fruit? You can beat it without eating the fruit. Yes. Oh, okay. I didn't yeah. know that. Yeah. So here we go. It'll Bubble eventually Bobble. just sort of take you. Now. Oh. It just takes you? It just takes now, you. Now it is the beginning of a fantastic story. Let us make a journey to the Cave of Monsters. Good luck. That is some fantastic writing. Yeah. Da, 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 English da, da. localization is so good. So these guys kind of chase you, and you have to pop the bubble. Um, and you can only do it by headbutting it from below or jumping on it from above. Yeah. And when they that die, they always annoyed me when I was younger. Uh, and the very last one becomes red and angry. I'm like, oh, I guess I gotta grab that, whatever it is. Kilbasa. <laughs> Green banana. <laughs> Green banana. So I got all the guys here easy. Easy peasy. Good all right, now we're, on, now we're on this meatball level. And, uh, <laughs> the world is meatballs. Now, I don't know what happens when you, uh, like, fail to pop them. Do they respawn or something? Yeah, they do. That sucks. Yep. Ugh. Oh, good job. Nice. Fuck you, red guy. I got I got reflexes. <laughs> Dinosaur reflexes. <laughs> Alright, so now we're in the uh, mirror E level, as we call it in the biz. Um, <laughs> the mirror oh, e. God. oh, you almost died. And oh, died. you died, but that, okay. that's okay. Uh, yeah, I, I realized that the challenge doesn't say I can't die. Nope. Oof. And see, I haven't popped that guy, so the guy hasn't turned red yet, so I guess that does mean they can respawn. Yeah. I'm like, nope, you're dead now, and you're red now. <laughs> and I was afraid of that bubble like exploding and hurting me or something. I don't know if it would. So I'm just trying to stay back. And this red guy just taunts me from the side. He's just... Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> I'm like, come on. He's like, nah. And he, he waits until I come towards him. Shit! Nice. Yeah, you bubbled his bobble. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> so then I get his fruit. And we're on to the fourth level. We're almost done here. Woo! We can do it. Shit. Fuck. You, you oh, died no. again. Uh-oh. Fuck, fuck. Uh, oh. Oh. Oh, oh man. Four. Password four. bib. <laughs> <laughs> level four. Oh, oh. What just happened there? It's, it's Everybody the got thing. muted. Yeah. Oh, I think I think we skipped a video too somehow. Did we? Um, yeah. Uh, okay, anyway, no, yeah, no, no, no. It's not skipped. Like you skipped it in the playlist. Anyway, um, so yeah, uh, failed bubble bobble too. Uh, so I've I failed uh, I think one, two, three and a half challenges so Poor far. Sir. This is not going well for me. My record is very tarnished for this episode of Nick Arcade Challenge. If you go back though. I do really well on the other episodes, so... Me sort of does. Yeah, well, we'll mm-hmm. see. Yeah. Um, so this next challenge I'm going to go back to in a second is uh, Goldeneye. Goldeneye 64. Yeah, Goldeneye. 
a game that totally stands the test of time. Um, <laughs> and it was uh, beat the damn level, slappers only. Uh, yeah. No guns, uh, unless the game requires me to use something else to progress. Um, and it does at one point, one single solitary point. Um, now, with the GoldenEye, I had a lot of trouble with the controls, because it's GoldenEye. It's so, terrible! Yeah, <laughs> controls so, are really shitty. So, pardon as I pause to switch back to my hand a whole bunch. Okay. All right, here we go. All right, and it's still got the save from when we played uh, multiplayer. Good deal. But I decided to start new, and I'm playing Agent because you didn't specify. I, uh, I did not. So we're going on the easiest one. I'm like, no, no, start. All right, here we go. So I am uh, I am James Bond, Pierce Brosnan. Uh, is he still alive? Who cares? Yeah, he is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm at the... Damn. <laughs> Nine years ago, this game is nine years old. Uh, so I'm at the gun, and I'm trying. I'm like, oh shit! I accidentally fired it. And I'm trying to figure out: is there a weapon switch button? Uh, maybe there is. I don't know. But I just decided to use my uh, my watch to switch to unarmed. <laughs> you have to use your watch to drop your gun. I pretty much do. Um, so I'm trying to figure out what's my karate chop button. How do I how do I karate chop? I think it's okay, Z, right? a, There we go. I got it. All right. So then, karate chop. I also say, it was... <laughs> well, you picked up a gun. I accidentally brought my gun back out, so I have to pause and switch back to my karate chops. Right. Uh, <laughs> you can do it. That's all right. So there's a guy firing at me. I'm kind of freaking out. Ugh. Take that, Fritz. All right, here we go. <laughs> They're Russians. His name is Fritz still, though. Look at these two guys. Really good guards. They're the best. He shot me a little bit, finally. Oh, wait, he's, a, he's really good at dodging karate shops, though. So, <laughs> Running away from them is perfectly acceptable. Yeah, that was a damage boost. That was a damage boost back there. <laughs> what um, was it? So, so here, here I'm like, oh, God, I'm going to go hide from bullets behind me. And I go up here to hide, and, oh, hey, body armor. Useful. Could be, if I can grab it. Ugh, God, go. controls for this game are so shitty. Real bad. Just real, real bad. Yeah. It was only um, fake analog. A little bit. Like, I'm using the C buttons for a lot of stuff. And now I'm kind of just, like, wandering around because it's hard to know where I'm going or where I'm supposed to go or what I'm doing with the controls. <laughs> <laughs> but I kind of figured this looks like the way to go. And I'm like, how do I activate this button? Uh, shit! No, not the gun! Not the gun! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so let's switch oh, back. Oh, how'd you activate the door? I, I don't know. I don't remember. <laughs> Here I go. I fiddle with buttons for a little bit. As guys shoot me. Accidentally switch back to your gun. So, Whatever so, you're so, pressing, <laughs> press it again. I, I don't know. <laughs> I almost quit the game here on accident <laughs> because the controls are so bad. Uh, um, luckily, the door is closed behind me, and I'm in a new area of the dam. And uh, here the game got pretty familiar to me. I remembered uh, I saw this guy running. I'm like, oh, wait, he's going to alarm guards. Yep. Too bad. Karate chop. Wow. You have a yeah. really good judo chop right there. When you, when you kick him with, when you chop him in the back, they die in one hit. There's a guy in the door there. I saw him trying to yeah, karate chop him in yeah. the door. That didn't work. And I can't go through this fence, so I guess I have to go through that building. And I decide, and since there's no door over here, I decide to open the door where the guy is behind using the same, the use button, which I don't know, may have been A. I don't, I don't care. <laughs> Look at the great graphics of of cylinder with face on it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I know who designed this area, but it's like here's a fence for no reason. Here's another one for you, no reason. You, you do have to use a gun here. I do, yeah. So yeah. I, I pull out my pistol and I aim it just a little bit and you pause. <laughs> Back to hands. Because I don't want to accidentally shoot somebody and lose the challenge. All uh, right, Mr. Bond. Let's get handsy. Ooh. Um, and then I remember I, I remember this part very clearly. But I know exactly what I'm supposed to do. And I remember it very clearly because the first time I ever played this game as a kid, I, I was playing on the same difficulty. I took a right and to go search these buildings and find stuff. 
And then I went to this next one and went through it and killed guys to find stuff. But the goal is jump off right here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Look at you. Yeah. So Good I am. Good job, am, Mr. Krua. Does, I like that he seems to jump off without taking any sort of precautionary measures. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Just And, then, and then he climbs back up and jumps off again. <laughs> <laughs> and then again. They, they told him he's being replaced by Daniel Craig, and he got really sued. <laughs> <laughs> so, All right. Success. Success. All right. Very nice. Good job. Um, two more left for me. Uh, this one, Now I was kind of riding high. I figured I'd uh, try a, a, a more difficult one. And this is a challenge also from Cody. Uh, newer one, Mortal Kombat 2. All um, right. I picked the uh, Super Nintendo version. Because uh, I was playing the SNES like crazy for these challenges, so why not? And on normal difficulty or higher, beat the first fighter using only uppercuts and without taking more than 50% damage. So I'm like, okay, let's try <laughs> it. Uh, can't be that hard, right? Right. So uh, let's give it a shot. Uh, now, I, I originally had recorded it uh, where I show you the difficulty options. Um, but I didn't capture it in this recording. Um, but it starts automatically on medium. Okay, that's fine. Um, I trust you. And um, this is this is like literally maybe the first time in my life, oh, Steve, um, I have ever used the block button in Mortal Kombat. Yeah. <laughs> um, good job. Luckily, he just kept walking into your fist. Yeah, so you're I feel, okay. I'm pretty good about it. Um. And I just didn't want to take damage. Ugh. Look at you. Alright, man. Boom. All right. Easy. Easy yeah. peasy. Full disclosure, I did fail the first time I tried this. Oh, um, really? But that recording didn't stick. So. <laughs> Alright. All right. Luckily, the second time I tried it... The... Didn't stick. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. uh-huh. <laughs> All right, sir. What are you doing? Huh. All, right. All right. All right. So um, my last challenge um, is from Nikki. And the challenge was beat the first world or level of any of the uh, first three major Mario games, Mario uh, 1, Mario 3, or Mario World, uh, blindfolded. Yep. Uh, <laughs> which is like the fuck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The Nick hardest Arcade challenge. for like... Extreme adult. Apparently. <laughs> Sweet. Um, I would watch that. Like, all right, now you get a bungee jump and play Sonic 2. Um, so I decided to do Mario World uh, again, mostly because I was already playing SNES games. Um, and was told that I could uh, pick either of the first two worlds yeah. uh, that you can start from. So I picked uh, the one on the right. And uh, I practiced. Well, you're seeing, you're gonna see the first time I did it blinded here, um, and I ran through the world. Well, I guess we'll just watch the video. Okay, let's do it. All right. So I am, I am currently blindfolded at this time, and I played the world prior to it with my eyes uh, three yeah. times, trying to learn music cues. Yeah. And, oh, that's smart. And failed miserably. Um, <laughs> you so can my, die five so I told times? My, I, told, I, told, I told myself, I, oh, was it five times? I told myself I'd give myself two times. Oh, okay. Yeah. Or three times, three times. One dun, game dun, over. Dun, 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 jump. Jump. And then I kind of get lost. <laughs> oh, no. But then as soon as I hear him running, I got to jump, like, on instinct. And then from here, I'm kind of You're just like... You're actually doing pretty well. <laughs> yeah. Um, this is actually the first time I've watched this. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't know how well you did. Um, I, mean, I do. Um, so... Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, you're going to oh. jump into the... Okay, at least you're, you're big. Oh, my God. What? Boom. Second try. Oh, my Done. God. Congratulations, Done. Matt. Done. That was awesome. I am I am proud of you, sir. I, I, I wish I had done what you did and like r r recorded myself with a blindfold on while I was doing it. 
Um, so I guess I have no proof, but please trust me I, I when trust I say you. that I, my eyes were closed, and I was very proud of that one. I trust us to not screw things up. I trust you. Man, I, yeah. that, was that awesome. is good. That's the hardest yeah. challenge right there. I think so, too. Um, so yeah, I think that's was, worth at least two victories. Yeah, I'll yeah. take it. So it evens me out. I think, <laughs> I think so. You're at, a, you're at an even zero. Fat and 500. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, that's it for me. Okay. Yeah, that was um, cool. It was fun, though. It was fun, though, this week. Good thing to end up on, Matt. Good job. Yeah. All right. Let's let's uh, let's get into mine. Um, and for my first challenge, uh, let me load up my list here. Um, I did the Sonic Spinball Challenge from Matt, which was to uh, have the scoreboard show 300,000 points or more within 30 seconds. <laughs> uh, the timer starts whenever launching up appears. Yeah. So let's give that a shot. Let's see if I do it. All right. Can I just say that uh, I don't know if this is possible or not? I <laughs> Seven seconds in, so. I uh, I just watched someone say, let's blind, let's play Sonic Spinball. And then I saw what his score was 30 seconds in. I was okay. like, that, that's the goal. Uh, yeah, I have no idea fucking clue what I'm doing. So I'm at tr- uh, like 20-something seconds in, and uh, I have... Oh, you gotta get up there, you gotta get up there and hit the stuff. That's the point. There's stuff up there to hit. Well... <laughs> I don't think you go hit it, do you? Uh, I, I, yeah, I, 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 I give up. <laughs> oh, you should, you should at least let yourself get eaten. I, I'm, I'm trying not to, but eh, whatever. I'm sorry. So it was a valiant effort. Yeah, yeah thank Good you. Drive. Had you yeah. Did you just like get the game and then just record your first effort playing? Uh, yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I I have not played Sonic Spinball since I came across it in a Sears in like nineteen <laughs> like ninety or whatever, whatever year it was. Wow. It Sonic Spinball is not very good. <laughs> well, uh, I know that now. Um, yeah. So, like, I, and, and, and this is coming from someone who appreciates bad Sonic games, Sonic Racing. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, uh, I I failed miserably on that one. Yeah. Um, so let's go into uh, challenge number two, which is another Matt challenge uh, for Super Smash Brothers Melee for the GameCube. Um, and this was beat event match two entitled King of the Jungle in forty five seconds or less. Basically, yeah. you're a giant Donkey Kong trying to kill a small Donkey Kong. Yep. Let's get into it. Yeah, the donkey rap. <laughs> you so can totally is... hear that this is the whitest guy in the world. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, there's one more life. Yep. Uh, he's really fucking hard to hit. Down smashes, down smash. I'm trying. Done. There we go. Success. Nice. I did it. What was time on that? 28.2818. Yeah. So, uh, good job, me. Good job. Yeah. Definitely. I'm proud of me. Um, yeah. So that was fun. Uh, sm- I always enjoy a good the Smash Brothers challenge. Um, yeah, I was trying to figure out. We'll have one every time from here on. Yeah, I, th- I think so. It's the easiest thing to <laughs> add challenges about. Yeah. Really. Okay. So, uh, all right. So for challenge number three, uh, I took a Nikki challenge which is for the Super Nintendo. Uh, and it's basically, uh, Nikki attempted this previously in the uh, the run of the show, where it's go and beat the genie levels of Aladdin because it's the one code she can remember for any password-based uh, system. Uh, so in the first genie level, you aren't to die once. In the second genie level, you can die twice. In the third, you can have a total of three deaths overall. Um, I think I said four. Did you say four? Well, I was going I for did. three. Well, um, more power to you. So yeah. let's see if we can do it. All right. This fucking game. Yeah. <laughs> it's right. it's like it, this is a good game, but I'm tired of these fucking genie levels, like forever. Yeah, they're, <laughs> they're hard. Like none of this even makes any sense. Like no. who, does, who was like who wanted to put this in the game? I, I guess they just wanted something weird, and the genie's lamp was a good way to go about it. Huh? You're standing on top of my head. <laughs> my multiple heads. Welcome to genie hell. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> 30 
Throw your apples, man. It's I kind of forgot I had them. It's all about throwing apples, brah. <laughs> and go back. Oh. What you, what's up? I like that he has, like, multiple heads, and then, like, he uses his arms for <laughs> pointing at things. <laughs> like, hold on, what is the, the playing cards? I don't know. It's the Ace of Spades. Ugh. So, so... He's a big fan of Motorhead? <laughs> yes. Like... Ugh. I was gonna say it's predicting your imminent death, but... Excellent. <laughs> so, uh, level one without any deaths. There we go. Very nice. Boom. Take that shit, idiot. <laughs> Fuck you, flying pot bird. <laughs> <laughs> Oof, oof. This is dangerous. That's not, I was wrong. <laughs> this is dangerous. I was incorrect, it's really easy. <laughs> now, this is dangerous. Yeah. You need to not bounce off the balloon. You need to swing. Oh god, okay. I decided bouncing off of it from the bottom would work alright. Big nabob. Okay, here we go. <laughs> What's that thing? Why was that? Why does that exist? <laughs> Good question. It's a weird green pillar. You definitely got to swing for this one, right? Oh fuck you! <laughs> fuck the gems. Who cares about the gems? Oh, is that a continue point? Oh, nice. Oh. Fucking tornadoes. You have Genie. a lot of hearts, that's good. Genie, you're supposed to be a friend. Yeah. Is it, is it friends you're don't right, I've never had a friend you like you, you fucker. <laughs> <laughs> oh! That, the tornado murdered me. Fucker, no! That sucks, but that's okay, because you get... Yeah, I get another shot. Yeah. yeah. Alibaba had them 40 thieves, Sharon Zod had a thousand tails. Uh, uh. I was very mad that I landed, and then I just walk off the edge. <laughs> so, uh -oh. uh, so I was actually doing pretty well until I walked to my doom. That's disappointing. That Isn't is. It? You were you were doing really well for yeah. the majority of that run. So. I was, very, and I had like no practice. I just fucking went right into it. So it was. Super I was gonna happy. Add, Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Uh, but, so, now I've added, two out of three I have lost, so that, that kind of sucks. But it's okay, because I got other challenges we can go through. Um, so I took one of, uh, our, our good friend Ambie's old challenges, which is, uh, Tiny Toons Acme All-Stars. Uh, and in that, you are supposed, there are three different sports that she chose, and you have to get first place in all three of them, which is Montana hitting, which is essentially whack-a-mole with Montana Max, uh, bowling, and an obstacle course. Uh, so I gave it a shot. I purposely did not do this challenge, because have you ever played this fucking game? No. It is awful. Uh, yeah, it is. It's fucking Let's shitty. Let's watch. This game is so bad. Story mode for a sports game. Yeah, all right. Yeah. <laughs> so then whack-a-mole, that's a sport. Yeah. Is he throwing bombs at everybody? The go go yeah, he's throwing bombs all over the place. Uh, things that you can't hit are also popping up. Uh, the controls are actually kind of bad. What? You're kidding me. <laughs> Yeah. Can you only hit them from the left and right? Yeah. You cannot That's face forward. Stupid. Which was really frustrating. And I don't really know, like, if I lose points if I hit the bombs. I wasn't paying attention. I was just mostly trying to figure out where the hell the goddamn Montana Max was going to pop up. Can you not hit Dizzy? Uh, I assume you lose points if you hit Dizzy or Elmira, so I didn't try. No, no Elmira's a villain. Why are they dropping hammers? Can you pick those up? No. If you get hit by the bomb, you drop your hammer. And then you just pick it back up again. So I won. 
Wow. Hey, I want that kind of hitting. Man, you were like, it looked like you were doing presented by Konami thing. You got credits. Yeah. Um, yeah, like it, you, it restarts like every fucking time. I thought you were doing pretty badly, but I guess you were I doing okay. Don't fucking know. So this is actually uh, takes for fucking ever. So I speed through the other players' turns in this, because otherwise oh, wow. we would be doing this for like hours. This is the shittiest looking bowling ever. Yeah, basically it's just line it up. I thought for a second, like before the the bowling match or whatever started. Um, that the orange or the yellowy orange was desert. <laughs> <laughs> no, was that on a strike? Exactly, right? Figure I'll just get at least get this one. I'm not even gonna try for the spare or the uh, well, yeah I, split. Like it looks like you're dominating. I gutter balled. Okay, I spoke too soon. <laughs> <laughs> but then I picked it there up. There you the go. Spare. I was not wrong. It looks like you're dominating. <laughs> I'm doing pretty well at this point. Uh-oh. Oh, he's getting nervous. He's getting nervous. I am. I know that I need to press the button with my reaction time. I need to press the button pretty much as soon as it hits the bottom. Uh, not quite. Uh, I still what? win. Nice. Five frames, huh? Yeah, right. yeah. Which is fucking good, because otherwise yeah. we'd be here forever. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. Goodbye. Yeah. So oh now let's gosh. try this. Car <laughs> Cartridge erases itself. <laughs> <laughs> I think your, your, your console sets on fire. Now the obstacle course. Oh, golly. Uh, Hampton looks upset. He, yeah, <laughs> he looks really concerned. All right. Oh god, this is like micro machines. So I'm right in the fucking lead. I'm doing this well. This is really, really poorly put together. I yeah. got no, hit by the more. balls, but it still says I'm in first place for some reason. Yeah, you're, then, you're, oh wait, no, it does. Then I Maybe jumped you're ahead. Player one? No, because now I'm in third place, even though I'm in the front. <laughs> what? <laughs> so I have no fucking. I I've quickly realized I have no clue how this goddamn obstacle course works. I just know that I have to keep pressing the button to run. That sucks. Yeah. So, pretty much even if I get, like, in the lead... Look at the rubber banding, Jesus. I don't even know if I'm going to be in the lead. <laughs> I'm in the lead and I'm in fourth place. I don't understand how this fucking thing What's works. that? I hit some kind of power-up that sent me to the back. The worst. You lost. Uh, so I lost, big time. And I don't really know how. <laughs> uh, that made no sense. That really, really terrible. That game was, like, the, I did really well the first two times, and then I had no fucking clue what was happening. It, in that it was really one. frustrating to watch. Like, yeah. the camera is, like, just a little too zoomed in. Yeah. Like, just, just enough to make it so, oh, yeah. Anything that's in front of you, you're not going to see it coming in time. No, you're just going to get fucking smacked. And then yeah. you may or may not fall into fourth place. We'll see. Yeah. And if you do, does it matter? Well, no. no, maybe. <laughs> we'll see. Yeah. Uh, all right. So for my next challenge, we have uh, just a few more. Um, we have Yo Noid, which is one of Matt's for the NES. And um, basically, I was to get 2,500 points within 30 seconds. And the uh, visual cue in game was that the timer needs to be above 110. Yeah. Um, so let's let's get into it. Yeah, I wanted to make some smaller challenges. And so I figured we'd use this game that I was hoping would be used for uh, Corporate Mascot Week sometime. Yeah. Well, I didn't use it for Corporate Mascot Week because I played this game, and I really yeah. like this game. And the score was, what, 2,500? 2, 2,500 is the, is the goal. All right. No. There's a lot going on on the screen. Like, yeah. they tried to fit in a lot of um, background and atmospheres. Yeah. Stuff. Yeah. It's a really cool game. It was. This was for the NES? Yeah. Yep. Yes! Oh, you did it! I did it! Nice. Done! I did it like, at exactly 111. On time. <laughs> yep. Wow. 
Look at me, I did it. Uh, so, okay, I'm doing better. Um, but now I decided for my last official challenge, there are two extras we'll get to if we have any time left, which we probably won't. But um, I decided to do Nikki's blindfold challenge as well. But sure. I chose to do the uh, Super Mario Brothers 1 because I am most familiar with World 1 1 there. So uh, let's give it a shot. All right. We played it over and over and over and over yeah. one night. So. so not me. I got past that easy. I uh, I filmed <laughs> myself uh, blindfolding myself and and playing the game. Is that a blindfold? Is that what we're calling that? Well, <laughs> it's what I had available. I tied a hoodie over I, my I, head. I don't know. <laughs> 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 you look ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate this this extra effort. No, definitely. All right, here we go. Mario Brothers and Plummins are game. <laughs> okay. You, wait, no. I heard the ding, so I'm like, maybe I can get the mushroom. No. Cody, no. The key to beating this blindfolded is to learn musical cues and speedrun. Uh, yeah. I, I didn't think about the musical cues. <laughs> nice. Oh. Oh. It's all right. We can we can but, die five times, is what she said. So yes, I figured it would be difficult. So it's the hardest goddamn one. Hit first, Goomba. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> The defeated, like just yeah. lowering of everything. I was, I was sad. Understandable. So I decided wait for the Goomba, you're, but didn't you're gonna realize wait for I had the Goomba. I didn't realize oh, I had. Uh, not anyway. Yeah. All right. I'm like, all right, mushroom. Oh, give me oh, mushroom. Oh, 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 you're gonna get it. It's good. That's awesome. Good job. There we go. Okay. Come on. Oh, oh no. Oh, no, that is, don't touch. That doesn't, oh, give you, that doesn't give you an extra attempt. Yeah. <laughs> no. Oh, oh, oh my god, do you know where you are? I I really have no clue. I'm just kind of hoping at this point. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> like, I think, and, and I did this during my run, like, I think the... <laughs> so I forgot I would probably gotten to the halfway point. Um, honestly, I think, I think that one would have earned you a mulligan. <laughs> I didn't really know how I was dying. I thought I was at the beginning. So, so I give up here. That's my favorite part of it. <laughs> Fantastic. So, I, I thoroughly enjoyed that. Well, good. Like, I'm glad. I think, I think the best strategy is once you don't know where you are, just keep going forward and jump every time. Never be on the ground. That's, that's kind of what I was trying to do is just jump a yeah. lot. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so anyway, so that's what we're going to go with for mine. We'll, we'll come back to my, my other stuff if we have a little bit of time. Uh, but basically... I lost most of the time. I did very That's poorly. That's okay. I, I really <laughs> enjoyed your blindfolded challenge. That was really yeah, good. Yeah. <laughs> that was fun to watch. You did, like, you got really close on both Aladdin and Acme All-Stars. I did. Yeah. I did. So it's not full failure. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, Nikki, you're up next. So uh, the first one that I did was one of Matt's challenges, the Sonic Spinball Challenge, where you have to get 300,000 points within 30 seconds. Um, yeah. This is the most right. anyone has played Sonic Spinball maybe ever. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure Sony, whenever this video comes out or this episode comes out, they're going to be like, oh! <gasps> Yay, someone People cares. Played. Yeah, we people cared for a minute combined. We should re-release Sonic Spinball again. <laughs> Said nobody. Alright, All right, so we're going to skip ahead. There we go. We were ahead, sorry. Dun 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 like, this fucking music, man. Yeah. Alright, so you got 30 seconds once you hit. Launching up, and I think that starts at 19 seconds. Okay. Seven, oh, okay, on my screen I saw 19, but either way, it's, it's fine. I have a total Nick Arcade moment, too, in this. Ooh, look at you! There you go, that's way better than me. 
Worm bag, bag them worms. Oh. Fuck you, chicken worms. Oh, get up there. I I just wanted to so badly. But needless to say, I failed the challenge with 215,000 points. Aww. That sucks. I'm sorry. Yeah, it was, it's so okay. Close. I was so close. Valiant effort. I yeah, I thought so. I think part of it too was you know I got like hung up against that wall, and just if I had a couple more seconds, maybe I could have gotten the extra yeah, points. Yeah, perhaps. But... It was, right. uh, you know, more luck. The video was <laughs> I couldn't, I couldn't grab that coin, even though it was right above my head. <laughs> <laughs> Depressing. Okay. <laughs> um, next? And then uh, next is one of, I think this is Cody's challenge, where you had to beat Green Hill Zone Act 1 in under a minute. Okay. Cool. So that is what I did. All right. Well, that's what I attempted to do. Watch Nikki get a hundred percent success rate. Be very frustrating. Well, no, because I just failed the Sonic Spinball. Oh, that's right. Challenge. Oh, wait, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Right. Okay. Do it. It's thirty seconds. No, I mean, right? a... he said a a minute for this one. Yeah, a minute. Yeah. Right? Okay. Mostly because that was uh, in generations. Uh, yeah, that was a one challenge. of the challenges. But the Green Hill Zone in generations is, I think, a little shorter. Is it? I think so. Ooh, it's frame rate. Yeah. It's bad, I know. <laughs> Boom. Oh, look at that. E easy peasy. Good job, yep. Nikki. Thank you. With, right. like, I'm sad like, I missed that big, you know. Yeah. That would, that, that would have been a cool ending, actually. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh, into the ring with time to spare. Yeah, like, quite a bit 20, of time. 23 seconds. All right. Uh, okay, so what you got next, Nikki? Uh, I think this is another one of Cody's challenges where you have to defeat uh, the first fighter in Mortal Kombat 2 uh, using only um, uppercuts. And I played the SNES version because I was playing SNES, I don't know, SNES games. So. You're playing Genesis, right? Did I say SNES? You did. Okay. I meant Genesis, yeah. Okay, that's uh, fine. <laughs> you said Sony earlier when you meant Sega. I think you're just dying. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I am dying. It's all that's right. sad. All right. Well, they're, they, they're coming up with a cure for early onset Alzheimer's. Here we go. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm, like, legitimately concerned about no, that. I, know, I, know. <laughs> I, know. <laughs> I was like, oh, that was a bad thing to say. <laughs> Extra controls. Yeah, I don't know what that's about. I assumed you meant medium, so that's yeah. what I went with. Yeah. So. Good choice. Good they job. all play the same as far as they all play. Go. Yeah. <laughs> but just Katana is my favorite, so. Yeah. Oh shit! You fucking there light you blue go. cunt. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Boom! Awesome. All right. Take that, Sub Zero. Fight. Dang. I don't think I remembered how much they just fucking walk into your fist in this game. In yeah, I wanted to go game. back and try it on like a harder difficulty, but I just I didn't have the time to go back and do it. Oh, so. well, that was a good job, Nikki. Excellent. Thank you. Congrats. Yeah, I, I wanted to try harder things. I felt that those were probably easier. We're, but we are Mortal Kombat buddies. We did it. We are. Yes, we are. <laughs> All right. Uh, that leaves us with, I think, one final challenge from Dylan, right? Yeah. So I did the Aladdin challenge. Um, All right. Uh, I, I want to do the Left for Dead challenge. I think I don't know where that challenge came from. Whose yeah. challenge was that? I, I think that was Matt's. Where's mine? No, my, yeah, I, I didn't remember doing that one. That's but I tried to do it, and then I realized that my Steam account is gone, and I don't have that game anymore. Your Steam it's account gone? is gone? Yeah, I had to make a new one. I'm locked out of my old one. Oh, that sucks. How are you? You, you can probably get it back somehow. I tried, and it was just 
horrible. Man, I sent you like games a long time ago. I should get those back. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, Try. <laughs> we'll get we'll get you back. But anyway, yeah, so, uh, so you did the uh, Aladdin challenge where you yes, eight die? minutes of it. Oh wow! <laughs> Whoa. Okay. So we don't need to watch it all, but um, it's just uh, yeah, I don't. Dude, well, let's let's just try it. Yeah. Okay. I have to watch eight more minutes of this game. <laughs> and it's sped up too. No, you don't have to watch eight minutes of this. I'm gonna be honest, like I think I hate friend like me. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't before. I think I hate this song now. All right, so far doing pretty good. Yeah, you got this. What is it like? How many deaths can you get? Uh, none in the first level. Uh, two in the second, and I I guess four in the last one. I... <gasps> oh. There you go. Oh. Doing well. This this usually can cause some problems depending on what he draws. Yeah. I think it's the exact right? same order that... Uh, you lost already! It, it is. Yep. Bye, keep going, because this is my only challenge. All right. So. <laughs> um, Another chance. He, yep. it, every once in a while, and it is randomly generated, he'll just do all clouds. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. Yeah, uh, that happened to me once. Um, I know when I was playing this, and Nikki knows, I was kind of bitching about it. Um, the game was glitching on me like that. Damn. Not gonna lie, Dylan. Uh, you've lost three times. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Let's yep. try again. All right. It was one continue, right? Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> I think I make it to the second stage <laughs> once. Wow. Oh, Dylan. Yeah. We'll watch it till... Uh... Don't you don't know. need to watch anymore. You can stop. All I right. failed. <laughs> okay, so Dylan failed a lot. <laughs> Did you ever beat it? I got to the second stage um, without dying. Um, All right. And, yeah, good. and then the second stage I died a lot, and then I said, fuck this. I'm going to play Left 4 Dead, and then I can play Left 4 Dead. This is eight and a half minutes of you failing. <laughs> 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 I think, I think the real Nick Arcade Challenge is if we watch the rest of this video right now. You know what's sad? I'm looking at the last frame where we paused, and he's got, like, the, um... The genie? The, no, well, not the... Well, the genie <coughs> itself is, is funny, too. But below the genie is the um, piece of fabric that you yeah. can use to glide and, um die less when you're jumping. <laughs> I, I saw that there. I was like, no, this has to be done fast. Oh my god. This <laughs> blows. Aladdin is the worst game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have turned around. That is not a good game. I've turned around on it completely. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I say that uh, why don't we record my stuff as sort of an extra that I'll upload, uh, my, okay. two, my two extras. But we'll go ahead and end the official show right here. If you want to go past an hour, go ahead and uh, I'll make an annotation and link to it in the show notes. Um, but before we go ahead and end the show, Matt, what are we playing next time? All right. Um, this is a uh, theme we've had before, but it's been quite. What episode number are we on now? We are fifty nine. So episode it's... sixty is next. So thirty episodes ago. So it's been a while. Um, and, it, and it's a pretty cool theme, actually. One that uh, should be pretty interesting. Um, we play a lot of bad games on this show. Yeah. Um, just kind of because that's the uh, that's the, the point. The point of it. Yeah. Um. But the the theme this time is to play games that everyone else thinks is bad, but Yay, I guilty, secretly love. Guilty Pleasure <laughs> Week. Guilty Pleasure Week is back. Last time we played stuff like the Strega, yeah. uh, <laughs> South Park Rally, and Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm. So this time, man, if I hadn't already talked about Dragon Ball, I'd pick that because man, that game's cool. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, so Guilty Pleasures Week. All right, that'll be fun. All right. Uh, well, look forward to that. In two weeks, we'll be playing that stuff. Uh, until then, I'm Cody Coleman. With me, as always, is Nikki Wright. Matt Krua. 
Dylan Frisbee. And until next time, don't die. And Dylan, what should they keep on doing? Blowing themselves? Oh, keep on blowing. <laughs> keep on blowing themselves. Hey, person watching, suck your own dick. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.